Right, so you just clicked on this video because your touchpad is not working. You've come to the right video. Yes, guys, number one video on YouTube. I'm going to show you guys how to fix the Acer issue with the touchpad. This is a common problem with Acer Aspire laptops. 5, 2, 3, 1, whichever model you got, it works on every Acer laptop. Okay, stay tuned. First, we're going to test out one basic function to see maybe perhaps it could be the issue. So look, this is Windows 11, it applies to any laptop. Look, touchpad is not working. Okay, I'm moving it around, no response. Typical Acer product. So this is what you need to do. First and foremost, press the F7 key. Yes, try the F7 key first. If that doesn't work, then continue to watch the other steps. So F7 again, no response. So okay. So look, it's not working, so stay tuned guys, and I'm gonna show you what to do. You need to obviously plug in the external optical mouse, any mouse, so just put that into the USB port, because we need to navigate without that, it's gonna be impossible. So, once that's in, you need to go to Device Manager. So yes, in the search bar, type in Device Manager. Can you see it's the top one there? But obviously you will not have this because already search for it. So you need to type in here, device manager, just like this. Okay, so this is all your hardware breakdown. So this is what your problem is guys. Here. Can you see? It's yellow. A warning sign so it's not working it's not functioning so if you go to properties can you see the device cannot start code 10 this is your problem this is where your problem lies guys and i'm going to show you how to rectify this issue can you see here serial io outdated driver 2 2006 what generally happens is when windows 10 or 11 any version of windows does an update automatic update sometimes the drivers get rewritten so it puts another driver on there and it clashes and the other one gets uninstalled right so we've diagnosed the problem sometimes in that device manager it does not show up that there's a warning that there's a problem so continue to the next steps so you need to connect to the internet So this is what you need to type in, www.google.com. In the search bar, I want you to type in Acer drivers here. Okay, so it's gonna be the first link. Click on that. Now identify your Acer device. So there's numerous ways of identifying your Acer device with the serial number, with the model number. So I'm gonna cut and paste it because I already copied the, the model number. So this is the laptop, this is the making model. So now what I'm gonna do, I'm going to move my cursor to drivers. Can you see? Drivers. So I'm gonna scroll down. So this is what you need to look for here. IO drivers, serial IO drivers. This is the one you need guys. So you need to click onto the download link Let that download. So I'm gonna confirm that it's downloaded onto my desktop download folder. This is it. The folders here so I need you to install this driver now scroll down until you see setup serial IO what I need you to do is double click on that file and install that driver select run
Now wait for the installation to complete. Yes, I want to restart my computer now. Make sure you do. Click on finish. Now your laptop or PC will restart and then it's going to be moment of truth. Right, here goes. I'm moving the touchpad and yes, it's responding. Please like and subscribe to the channel guys. This has fixed the problem.